good Wednesday morning, South Florida. Sweater weather it is. Grab a light sweater or jacket, possibly one or two, depending on how sensitive you are to temperatures in the lower 60s in Miami. We have 62 degrees in Fort Lauderdale, 71 in Key West. Winds out of the northwest, anywhere between 6 to about 15 miles per hour. But it's how it feels as you walk out the door when you get hit with one of these wind gusts. Ooh, it's chilly out there. Our winds are anywhere between 6 to 13, 15 mile per hour winds right now reported in the Keys. And we have our winds gusting in the 20s. This has allowed our temperatures to drop anywhere between 5 to 11 degrees cooler than yesterday. You are feeling the change in the air. It is cool, it's crisp, it's refreshing, especially with our dew points in the 40s and 50s. Yes, you're going to need to open up those windows and doors and enjoy this refreshing change. Turn off that AC, most likely driving this morning. You're going to need the seat warmers. Oh, it's so nice. I know I did all of that. It's so great. The good news is, is this weather sticks around until we get into the first half of the weekend as even colder air is going to move in tonight. It's right now placed over the northern half of the state. We're looking at their temperatures in the 40s and 50s as well. We are going to see that cool air continue to slide down the state as we have another front moving in. It's right now moving over the northern half of the area and uh, right over the panhandle that will slide more southward. Meanwhile, we have an atmospheric river starting to occur out west. So the series of storms out west will continue to head eastward and you'll notice that on our seven day forecast because we're expecting another front to move in as we go into next week. Temperatures you can see from coast to coast, 30s, 40s, a little bit warmer out in the southwest as they are ahead of that next front, but then very chilly across the Midwest and the Ohio Valley, 20s and 30s and 40s across the Northeast. So we'll have a cool morning giving way to really nice afternoon. Our highs are going to struggle to reach the low to mid 70s because of that north breeze and that reinforcing front. Now tomorrow we're going to be downright chilly. We're going to say chilly change. Cold weather is in place, definitely feeling like December finally tomorrow with lows expected to be in the 50s for every area except for you in the Keys, but still chilly. We're talking temperatures in the low 60s. With that being said, the coolest start to the season was last Wednesday at 59. I think tomorrow we could see our temperature drop down to 57 and that will be nearly 10 months ago was the last time we felt 57. On top of that, we are expecting a wind chill factor. The winds are going to be light enough, so we will actually feel temperatures even colder than the air temperature, meaning feels like temperatures could be in the low 50s. Headed to the beach or doing any boating, there's a moderate risk of occurrence for you beachgoers. Boaters, the bays will be at a moderate chop. I do have to tell you, the breeze will pick up tomorrow, causing a high risk of occurrence for beachgoers and boaters. But again, today barely reaching the mid 70s for highs. Tomorrow, even colder. Tomorrow afternoon, cool. And then you see the subtle warm up, and that's because of the next front that'll be moving in by the weekend.